Guys, horrible performance today. Horrible performance. We lose 3 nothing at Stamford Bridge. Milan second on every single ball. Uh, second in every single department today. Uh, the Chelsea midfield overwhelming uh, Milan's uh, midfield. Uh, we couldn't create anything. Leao barely touched a few balls. Giroud didn't touch any. De Catelar today. Uh, very timid. Very timid. Like he needs to get into it. Uh, Krunic, Baloture get yellow cards in the first 20 minutes. It obviously conditioned their uh, game. Uh, guys, Milan was just second best today. Chelsea today, good performance. But it started off with Milan sort of controlling the pace, controlling the ball, couldn't create any chances, but just holding the ball. But you can see that every time Chelsea got the ball back, uh, they, they moved quickly towards the net. And you could see already that it was going to be a hard game for Milan because every time they took the ball, they got to the net. And so, uh, like I said, first 15 minutes, okay. Uh, then back pass from Tonali to Tatarusano. He doesn't handle it well. It goes off for a corner kick. And off that corner kick comes the first goal because four consecutive corner kicks, guys. Four consecutive corner kicks where Thiago Silva, who's a beast at 38 years old, got a header every single time three straight, straight headers from uh Thiago Silva on the net uh creating chances uh Tatura Asano actually makes a great save on the first shot and then uh Fofana off the scramble scores but like I said nobody picking up Thiago Silva the only one running in the midfield today was uh Tonali Ben Asar with a captain's armband uh should have went to Tonali by the way um he didn't convince me today. He didn't convince me today. Uh, whole, held on to the ball too long. Like he, Nothing. Nothing today. Nothing, guys. Nothing. When I say nothing, nothing. So Fofana scores in the first half. Milan get one chance the entire game. And it's the chance they create at the end of the first half. Uh, Leao beats his defender. Uh, shots on net. Gets a rebound. Krunic comes in. Hits it. I think too hard. I think he wanted to bury it, but it gets deflected also by the defenseman. Mm -hmm. It was the only chances Milan created. The only chance. The only chance Milan created the entire game. Uh, second half, Aubameyang scores. A uh, mistake by Tomori. He completely forgets him in the back and he tries to get the ball, but he completely leashes the ball. And so Aubameyang all by himself scores. And then James scoring the third goal on the... Uh, um, on Tatarusano's like post, like he didn't even put his hands up. Yes, it was a hard shot, but dude, come on. Anyways, uh, not to count that the there was a missing mount goal that was this all for offside, but the way he came out for that ball, guys, Tatarusano, all over the place for that one. That being said, Milan lose, they lose uh, three nothing. Not a good performance. Not a good performance. Nobody on that team should be happy today. Uh, Pioli takes Leao out at the 70th minute. I guess he was thinking about the uh, Juventus game. But, uh, guys, not enough. Not enough today. And we got beat by a very good team. Uh, credit to Chelsea. Chelsea uh, with their new coach, Potter. It was his first game in the Champions League. Uh, they win. And uh, all of a sudden, this group stage uh, with this defeat, a bit harder. Because not everybody is about the same spot. So uh, it's going to be very important, the return game in Milan, that we can win this game. It's not going to be easy. Like I said, Chelsea, a very good team. And so uh, bad, bad all around, bad all around. Horrible, 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 horrible. So let me know what you think in the comments. Like and subscribe, guys. Uh, unfortunately, today, not a good day for Milan.